Journal community. I'm Josh Bootsma, Managing Editor of the Lansing Journal. The Lansing Journal exists to build community by keeping people informed and connected. And today we're connecting you to something you may have already seen in use. That is the Lansing Skate Park here at Park Plaza in Lansing. And we're here with two of the finest gentlemen I could imagine to help us <laughs> introduce this skate park. Thank you. Can you introduce yourselves to mm -hmm. uh, our viewers today? What's up everybody? I'm Kimo Supremo. Yeah. I'm Gnarly Jargon. We're from Royal Skate and Apparel. <laughs> Which is right here in Lansing. Give us your address. Uh, 3435 Ridge Road, right behind us. You'll probably right see there. it in the frame, yeah, actually, right I hope back so. there. <laughs> so is it fair to say you gentlemen are kind of excited that this now exists right behind uh, the business this, here? For me, personally, it's the best thing that ever happened. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I'm thrilled about this part. Mm -hmm. it's awesome. awesome. Yeah. It's, it's a very like... big upgrade from the other one. Oh, my God. Yeah. It's and good. you're talking about up at Bach Park, the other, the old, now we're We'll refer to it as the old skate park. You're right, 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 right. This is the new one. 2002 we were skating there. Oh, yeah. I grew up there almost, you know. <laughs> I like that park a lot, but, you know, come on. <laughs> yeah, right? It looks, it looks so awesome. Can you tell us a little bit about your skateboarding experience, how you got into it, and just a little bit about yourselves? All right, you want to? Uh, yeah, I started uh, five years old, my fifth birthday. Uh, so 1988. I'm 40 years old now. So 30, 30 plus years skateboarding in five different skate shops. and. Uh, I've been skateboarding since I was like five year old, just on my knees pushing around, and, uh, <laughs> like the biggest stair sets, and mm. drive my parents crazy. So, <laughs> <That's awesome. laughs> doing it forever. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, maybe not since I was five. I started officially skating when I was in high school. Like I was okay. uh, like fourteen. I'm thirty four now. Uh, three skate shops, not like twelve like this guy. But <laughs> um, uh, when I first started skateboarding, there was no skateboarders in our area, and like there's just one guy doing like little tricks off like a little like a like a park bench almost. It was tiny, hmm. but like blew my mind, yeah. and it really, like got me into skateboarding. And like I, ever since then, it's been like Tony Hawk's Pro Skater, and like trying to get you know into a skate park or something with somebody. You know, I didn't you start know. doing real tricks until Lansing in the '90s. There was a big skate scene back here, mm -hmm. and uh, skating in the East Hardware parking lot, mm -hmm. like the, the Burnham. Uh, Ridge Road over yeah. here, that okay. bank over there. Like it was a big scene okay. back in the nineties. So mm -hmm. that's how I learned a bunch of my skate tricks was from Man. This dude's like a vampire. Yeah. He's like he's seen every <laughs> every age of every skateboard. Age of skateboard. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Everybody so, knows this guy. Yeah. Was, <laughs> you're talking about like starting it like it's, it's very organic. Like you see mm -hmm. someone do a trick, mm -hmm. you're like, oh that looks cool. Mm -hmm. It strikes me that that's kind of what this sport is. Is yeah. it's just very organic. Like mm -hmm. and I think that maybe is challenging for people because they don't know exactly like what it is mm -hmm. like if you say oh i play basketball people know i go to the gym mm -hmm. the game starts at this time mm -hmm. the ref knows the rules and you play basketball mm -hmm. but it seems like it's a lot more of like a recreational hangout kind mm -hmm. of culture so i know there's not really a question there but can you help us understand like when you go skateboarding do you have a specific time that you're going every day? Do you have specific tricks you're working on? Or what is that like? Uh, to me, uh, skateboarding is more like, like you said, a culture, but it's like, it's like art, almost art, you know? It's like, <laughs> you, if you pick up your skateboard, no matter what you do on it, you're yeah. skateboarding, you know? So there's guys who are like, oh, I just use my board to go from one place to the next place. There's sure. guys who like, they just spin around in circles. Yeah. <laughs> and you're like, subjectively, you're like, oh, well, like that's not a skateboard. I'm like, no, well, it is, he's on a skateboard. Yeah. <laughs> you know? So it's a, it's a really big form of expression. Like there's no real right or wrong, wrong way to do it, hmm. you know, and like, um, there, it just all depends on how you see it. There's different know? styles. Like mm -hmm. we call them like hash skateboarders, where mm -hmm. they do nothing but like vert mm -hmm. or like they fly like, around. I wish I could do that. Cruising around, but there's there's guys called street skaters like me. Like I skate mm -hmm. handrails and like little awkward ledges mm -hmm. and stuff like that. So mm -hmm. flip tricks and all the mm -hmm. little fancy technical stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So there's different types of skateboarders, and it all depends on like maybe like the music sometimes yeah, or, or like. like just stop the person, players, you know, like, and like, yeah. like there's stuff that like I wish I could do, but like my body's just like, nope. <laughs> sure. <laughs> like the culture is growing, so now it's like everyone's gotten a uh, an interest in it lately. So okay. it's you see every everyone skates now, you know. So I, I, this I how I see it, like being the skate shop in the area. It's like man, everybody skates. Whoa, <laughs> you know, the great Olympics for business. Right? <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. an Olympic sport, right? Mm -hmm. Olympic sports, and like we're in the Olympics now, and it's like. 
kids are, are picking it up like basketball. Mm -hmm. Especially yeah. like basketball courts mm -hmm. are around, like skateboards are popping popping up everywhere. So. Yeah. That's yeah. pretty cool. It's awesome. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Especially for a shop owner like Yeah, you know. <laughs> right. See the big grade. <laughs> so you were telling us before we started filming that well, like when a new park opens like this, mm -hmm. people are trying to be the first one to do a specific type mm -hmm. of trick on, you know, this piece or that piece or mm -hmm. that's that that's part of the culture there too, is yeah. being the first one to do something here. Uh -huh. It's almost like you get remembered for what you, you he was, somebody already did that trick there. Mm -hmm. Like go down in history. Jesse already did the O'Malley flip. Shout out to Jesse. Yeah, he so did. you already got that. <laughs> like it's already been done. So I mean you can do it. Anymore. So you can do it you if can, you want. But it's, it's not just, as cool. You know, there's you like with the steezy stuff. That's like this like legendary <laughs> factor. <laughs> you know, yeah. it's like I was the first to do it. In the memory course. Mm -hmm. Filming is a huge part of the culture too. Huge. Yeah, so if, if you don't get it on camera, it doesn't happen, mm -hmm. or what? Yes, yes, absolutely. <laughs> you can be anything. You gotta be able to prove it. So film it, everybody out there, film it. All right, <laughs> film it. NBD, hopefully. Nah. Skate park to sidewalk. Where? Shit, head. Where? Ah, uh, here. I'm sure that's I'm not easy. Yeah! You know, you got it, old man! Yeah! <laughs> of course! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Alright, so this skate park here, first impressions of, of what we have right here. First I'm, impressions of the park. I will say, me, like this is probably the most unique park that I've ever skated. If not, for one, <laughs> I've never skated a pump track, and mm -hmm. like this is one of the funnest things that I've found. Your legs will get super tired, but like it's super fun. Uh, the obstacles are like, they're like, the size of them are great for beginners and people who like have like really technical movements because like it, it's, it's small enough for you to get on but big enough for you to have to really you know do the movement you know and um, there's they like there's parks that like their their obstacles are way too big and you have to be like a pro to skate them and then there's a really tiny little stuff but, but this one's like got a really good blend to me and uh, there's like a, there's like street sections like you stuff for like a street skateboarder and then there's like um, um, like vertical vert sessions for like sections for people who have more of a like a flowy kind of style so it's got, it's got a little bit of everything like I love that the coping the, the rail the, the cement is all nice and smooth it's a perfect <laughs> like blend of everything that's put together mm -hmm. like I remember the skate park in Bach Park it was like wood and like nails sticking out sometimes and like awkward metal to wood it's like hmm. it, it's not as good as cement with the type of metal that they're using so okay. it's like the perfect layout for what they have nice um, Shout out Always Hard Concrete. Yeah, yeah. Always Hard Concrete. Yeah. So good. They did a great <laughs> job. <laughs> okay, things that I've seen that I don't like. When people bring something to eat or something to drink, they bust their bottle and then have the skate park be all like Ooh, with right, glass, glass on the ground. Skateboarders, like, we hate that. I mean, <laughs> we hate that. Pavilion. Just pavilion. don't pavilion. do that. Pavilion. Food and drink is for the pavilion. Yes. Period. You okay. know, we pick like, up your trash. Pick up, like, we really like having a clean space because, like, a mm. pebble will make us fall. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, sure. like, a giant cup and <laughs> out of nowhere, you know, it's like, it's, don't do that. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. So yeah, I'll, uh, yeah, and we're gonna make sure we keep this place clean because it's like, it's our park, you know, so it'll be, you know, and skateboarders are very protective of their parks because, you know, we don't, normally don't have anywhere else to skate. So, yeah, right, you know, right. That's, that's, that's pretty big. <laughs> well, I think what we have left is to uh, have some. Some real skateboarders show us yeah, what this park is capa <laughs> capable of. Yeah. All right. Film winter didn't happen, right? So let's All right. Yeah. You're right. <laughs> exactly. You know, you got to no, be confident. I'm sure somebody else did. <laughs> Believe in yourself. <laughs> yeah, keep up. Top seven. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> You're a good filmer, I saw that. <laughs> what is like the what's a first step that someone can take to start to explore the world of skateboarding? Okay. Uh, get a nice sturdy skateboard mm -hmm. uh, the the best equipment. Like you don't want something from like the big box stores because it's not it's not gonna roll right, it's not gonna feel right, it's gonna break off more faster than a, a professional board. A professional boards will last you longer too. Uh, definitely wear pads, be safe. Make sure you have somebody mentoring you, like giving you tips and tricks, make sure you're safe. So, but it takes hours of practice. Mm -hmm. like, you gotta just get used to your board, ride around a bunch, mm -hmm. get your balance down because it's a whole new, whole new thing. Absolutely. I think um, I would say don't be afraid, you know, mm -hmm. like, like, okay, or... You're gonna fall. You're going to fall. <laughs> you're going to fall. I, I fall all I the fall time. It's of. like, it's, it's okay. You'll get tough, you'll be fine, <laughs> you know? Um, but it is better to try to learn from somebody. If you can't, if you can't, you know, just take your time, you know, stay within your uh, ability. Some people will see something that was like crazy, but I wanna do that. Like, wait, <laughs> you should probably learn how to stand on it first. <laughs> also, if you're in an area where you have a skate shop, typically they're doing lessons and stuff like that so just go to your local skate shop talk to them about you know i'm going to get into skateboarding if you're at a really good spot they'll be really helpful and really tell you in the ways that'll get you there just like us but you know there's other guys that will do it too <laughs> well no trip to the lansing skate shop is complete without a mm -hmm. stop at royal skate and apparel right? exactly exactly so let's go chemo show show us around your shop come on check it out Ta-da, Ta we do skateboarding. <laughs> <laughs> we also do clothing. We have our own clothing brand. So like we have, make sure everyone can come and support cool. when they want to, you know, Love Royal that. Gear. We also have everything that you would need for a uh, skateboard setup. You know, your trucks, your wheels, your bearings, everything that you could actually need to build a complete skateboard. And we put them all together for <laughs> for free with these lovely assistants here. Right. <laughs> you know? you. We also sell vintage clothing. And, uh, and other skateboard clothing. So we have vintage here in this lovely area. And we also have other local brands and other uh, skateboard brands that we supply to our community. So yeah, come on down. We're 3435 Ridge Road. <laughs> so if someone comes and you don't, they don't know what they want as far as like starting, you can help them out? Exactly. If you, if you come in here and you're like, I want to learn how to skateboard, we will put you completely in the game. We'll tell you from A to Z what you need and how you can use it. So absolutely, for sure. <laughs> awesome. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Kimo, for showing us around. Thank you, Gnarly, back behind the counter back there. Oh, this has man. been a really, really fun time getting to know Royal Thank Skate. Thank you so much for really coming. Fun. <laughs> Come out and enjoy the uh, new Lansing Skate Park. Really yeah. fun. Yeah.